The curtain dips in two and there in our sight the Holy of Holies manifest to all who seek to enter in. Messiah opens the way for those knocking asking and seeking. The invitation to come on in takes place within each of us through Christ and cannot take place in a church or organization. He sits waiting for us to enter in to fall at this feet to worship him. That curtain is still ripped open. Many unknowingly sew the curtain back up to deny each one who seeks God's face their rightful place. The Caribbean step aside because you belong to Christ and you can go with confidence right into his presence to worship he who is worthy. This is walking in spirit and truth. This is our sacrifice a life of worthy and praise and to live lives humbly and with justice and mercy towards others. This is the true freedom. The place of true love for us all. Don't hold back for entering in. In the past this was not possible when Father dwelt with man in the physical temples. Only appointed ones could do so to represent the people. But thankfully Father made the way for us all form every tribe nation and tongue to enter in and no man I repeat no man is able or can stop those who with the revealing of Christ in them go boldly and to claim their place. It's not once a year or month or on special days but day and night we can enter in spiritually. The distractions of the world do make it difficult to have this perception within them always but we can grow into the fullness of Christ within if we keep on. You are joint heirs with those first century faithful ones who took their place when Messiah returned for them as he promised them. We too claim our inheritance given freely out of love foremost because of what Christ did for us on the cross. Brother Paul rightly said. Therefore, brothers, since we have confidence to enter the most holy place by the blood of Jesus, by a new and living way opened for us through the curtain, that is, his body let us draw near to God with a sincere heart in full assurance of faith. Hebrews 10:19-22. When we finally realize sin has ceased then we will all be set free from the bondages and conditioning put upon us by manifest. Accept what Messiah did and enjoy your freedom in Christ. For Christ did not enter a man-made sanctuary that was only a copy of the true one, he entered heaven itself now to appear for us in God's presence. Nor did he enter heaven to offer himself again and again, the way the high priest enters the most holy place every year with blood that is not his own. But now he has appeared once for all at the end of the ages to do away with sin by the sacrifice of himself. Hebrews 9 24-26